Dr. David Green, CEO of Preferred Pain Center here in Phoenix and Scottsdale, Arizona. Today I'm out here at the Barry Goldwater Memorial. It's in Paradise Valley, which is a suburb of Phoenix and Scottsdale, Arizona. Mr. Goldwater is an icon in Arizona history, five-time U.S. Senator, one-time presidential candidate. He was called Mr. Conservative. I have some quotes here from Mr. Goldwater, one of which was, the income tax created more criminals than any other single act of government. That was attributed to Mr. Goldwater. Another one, you don't need to be straight to fight and die for your country. You just need to shoot straight. We cannot allow the American flag to be shot at anywhere on earth if we are to retain our respect and prestige. So the topic for today is whiplash. Whiplash is an epidemic in this country and it is predominantly the result of car accidents. Well, how big of a problem is it? Well, in this country alone, there are approximately three million episodes of whiplash every year. So how much money does it cost this country to take care of whiplash with the direct and indirect costs that go in for medical treatment, legal issues, things like that, $43 billion. So it's a huge problem. The total cost for low back pain in this country every year is around $100 billion. So let me just start by throwing out some facts in addition to what I just said about whiplash. Whiplash is most commonly the cause of a rear end uh, accident injury. In a car accident, when you get rear-ended, it takes much less velocity to sustain a whiplash injury than it does from a frontal impact. One of the main reasons that that's thought to be so is because when you're hit from the rear in a car accident, you don't have awareness that it's going to happen. You don't have the time to prepare for that. When, when someone's coming to you from the front, you have a, a millisecond to actually prepare your body um, or strengthen up, tighten up your muscles to prepare for that impact. You don't have that in a rear end uh, impact, so the velocity can be much lower. Well, when you get hit, obviously the neck goes forward and backwards and forward and backwards, and the injury that is sustained can be either substantial or it may be thought to be mild at first and then become a problem later on. 10% of people who sustain whiplash injuries end up having chronic neck pain. In addition to that, half of people who have chronic neck pain can look back and say, you know what, I had a car accident in my history that contributed to my chronic neck pain. So it is very common, it's very common that it can cause residual effects. The most common injury associated with whiplash is not a muscle problem. The muscle problem is a result of the injury that is sustained, either a ligament uh, tear or a sprain. So it can be a ligament issue. But the most common thing is a facet joint injury. Facet joints are those small joints in the back of the neck that are about the size of a thumbnail on each side. Those can sustain either cartilage damage or an injury to the capsule around the joint, and that can lead to chronic pain. One of the best treatments that we have for facet-related pain from whiplash is either a medial branch block, there's another video I have discussing that, or a radio frequency ablation. At any rate, we have very good treatments for whiplash. Getting treated sooner rather than later can help prevent acute pain from whiplash going into chronic. And one last thing, a lot of people think that whiplash injuries, the pain from that, a lot of it is as a result of fraud. People trying to outdo the insurance company to get a settlement. Well, there was a study done years ago by one of the large insurance companies who obviously have a vested interest in not paying out for fraud. And they found that only 10% of claims made on the result, as a result of whiplash were actually from uh, fraud. So at any rate, Preferred Pain Center, we have board certified fellowship trained pain doctors along with chiropractors, therapists, um, acupuncture, spinal decompression, which can help with pain related to whiplash and car accidents. We get patients in very quickly. We have a 24 hour guarantee on getting patients in for their initial exams. On the web, we're at preferredpaincenter.com. I run the blog of pain, which is preferredpaincenter.com slash blog. 
give us a call today, Preferred Pain Center, your pain stops here.